and welcome back and give it to, to close uh comments about uh what things I'll talk about today and this week um uh, reward against Buddha Public School salute um Buddha Project Reform I say this uh without a great success uh the Buddha Buddha and of course the book the project of Buddha Project you see on the website on Facebook and called Cartoon Network with Stop Buddha Speak Up. There will not be no other social media relate against Buddha and of course there will be no uh, war against Buddha in public school web page. Well, I'm not the web page. And of course, I made that on Facebook. Hopefully, soon with this great success, hopefully in the future, he become a website page and market that as well. But I want to close about um, for Tyler family who lost their son uh, due to suicide. I know uh, my bless. We always could be with them, of course. Keep y'all head up. I know things gonna be better. And of course, sad is school system still refuse to take responsibility for the action. Of course, um, and of course, sad if they were a public school all today. Um, so that's what about um. See, think but is not gonna happen. But but it's always gonna happen every time. But they turn and pray for the family. And also for Alex, you know, uh, a young teenager boy who been honking building every day by these unruly student grab him, choke him, rest, and of course beat him up, hitting him. And the parents of Alex went to the school many times because they didn't take responsibility for their action, but they didn't want to take the responsibility action because they don't care because they the school system all messed up today. You know, it was messed up um, when what happened. Uh, um, I'm going to put it out like this. Because school system is messed up not today now with these kids. Don't want to go to school and learn. They want to come bully other kids who are trying to go and learn with the Educate to graduate. But what happened to us today, last update uh, back in 2013, him and his family relocated from Ottawa to Oklahoma City. They tried to get out that town to move to another um, better place, of course, a better school. Since the school district he used to be in, still to know what they actually are these kids doing every day on the school bus. And of course, that district failed to protect them. And of course, they failed all time. And of course, the family did join them. Get the kids into better school and change their life. One thing I want to say before I close them, I want to salute this to Long Street Lady May Jackson. I got to turn my camera back around and see uh, what she would look like back when she was age 14. And of course, she's not utterly, and of course, she's uh, not stupid. 
with a uh, let me turn around picture. I should say not my picture. I should mention my cam back around to see what may and J May Jesse look, look like back she was fourteen. Okay, there he is. Um Yep, she not ugly cause she beautiful. And we're fourteen. I know she made a mistake which she did, but uh she learned for him and um spent three days mental hospital to help to change her life. And of course when she released back in three months, she was happy to be home, but she did not want to go back on the school bus because uh, she if she returned to that school. She we are with people and then she and them most worlds. Um that's why school system today continue to fall fail to protect these kids who come to school to learn. But for her, she come to learn. That's all. And uh, it's her today. Smile happy. Uh, she um, move on the bad things and she won't put things what happened to her back in 2009 behind her. And she on her way up, she got um, a great decent job, of course, going to college. And um, one day down the road, she probably help others that bullying is not okay. And uh, my salute to her he is always a gorgeous smile. She enjoys life. And then she never, like you say, when she graduated, she never wanted to see these kids who bully and harass her never again. Matter of fact, I don't blame her. And of course, when you graduate like I did, I didn't want to see uh, the bullies people no more. And don't hold on a grudge because if you hold on a grudge, they get on power. Just remember, kids who do the bully are nothing but a low light loser. Like I can say, kids, you're on the school bus or you're going to school to learn, just ignore the bully. Do not pay no attention to these losers. By the way, my method for the kids who on that video who pick on bully, the kids, they all lose them. I know one young lady, um, when we saw the picture, I know she learned her mistakes. She not think about it the most. She happy because she enjoyed her life. And of course, and now she got a kid now. Well, I don't know if they're a child or not, but I will probably be that alone. But by the way, I'm happy she uh, live a happy life working, and of course, in college. And of course, my final message to for her: Don't worry about these these kids lose them. Don't let them to bring you down. I know they bring you down before, but don't let them bring you down no more. Because I've been there too. They're trying to get me down, but. I keep get back up. That's what you gotta do. Keep get back up. Move forward. And don't think about these losers. Bully. Kids do the bully. It's not all losers. All them losers. Who pick on innocent children. Who try and learn to get education. That. Go do it. For the war against in public school. I like it. Um, spec salute this to Bully Project. Thank you so much to do the movie 
and of course, uh, she can turn into share thing about but it's no joke. And called for Blue Project, it go over uh, a million people on Facebook and of course other social media relate to Blue that stop for the speaker who are out there on to all the nation of uh, community uh, uh that there will be no in Blue to uh, the war against Bully in public school or any other social media that link uh are one hundred percent against bully. Thank you guys and God bless y'all guys. Alright, we're gonna look forward for next week on the war against bully public school. I'm gonna be talking about Steve King novel. Yeah, I made in the movie Carrie, a hit movie in nineteen seventy six and of course uh the remaker in 2013, it's about a long teenager girl who been bullied and harassed, and thing got better for her when she met that guy. And then on one prom, that laugh and tear her like a the bucket of pit. Dump her. I'm gonna talk about the Stephen King novel, Carrie White, coming up. Uh, next week on the war against the public school. And of course, also, um, um, before I go, um, I got a special I'm going to do coming up on uh, my last video of 2015. going to be a little salute. Sturdy High School 50 years. Uh, it could be uh, 50 years of the back and course, bullying has always been the main problem and that's good, but we work together, we can put it in for bullying once and for all. I had that uh, 50th anniversary salute uh, by decade of Washington Star High School story coming up um, soon. In the month of December, that coming up on so in the month of December, so stay tuned for that. But until then, and for now, I'm Danny King doing. Thank you for joining us, and we look for you <laughs> right back here next week. So everybody.